is pretty central, which is the main thing for me because it's downtown. Honestly, the location is just key. Like it's absolutely like it's in probably the best part of town that you can you can get. Just I enjoy like meeting people and uh, it's, I feel like that's sort of what this building is, is about. It's really cool. Um, I think it's very really convenient, especially the location here. We have many like, grocery stores and two TCC stations. And it's really close, close to the York campus. I think it's a really nice place, uh, especially because of the location. So it's really central and it's like really near to downtown. And it's really, it's almost inside the uh, UFT campus. So for UFT students, which is my case, it's really good. It's a great place for students, especially international students, to, uh, to get a place to live. Since, since you have to usually you know, see a place before you rent it, and that's not the case at Arts College. It's great. I like it a lot. Like, it's affordable. Mm -hmm. I can stay here. Everything's kept clean by the staff. Really good. Um, I think from my four years of university, this has been the best residence I've lived in. Um, it's very convenient, very comfortable. The rooms are really nice and like equipped with everything you need, all the shelves. There's lots of storage room, the beds are comfortable, so I really like it. If you like food, there's a food place right downstairs, you know, Masters, and they have pretty good food there. The view? Yeah, yeah especially it's facing south. Uh, I see CN Tower, the financial district, all the, you know, the skyline. I get to have my own room, but then I also have roommates. Mm -hmm. that, like, I have this kind of connection with them, but then also I get to like, go into my room and have yeah. my own space at the end of the day. I think it's really good that um, you gotta live with other people, but not like in the, some school residence, you live in the same room, but you have even the same suite, but different rooms, so you can. Um, experience the life of living with other people, other students, but also have your own private space. Yeah. Mm, how close it is to, uh, to uh, all the different university campuses around, mm -hmm. and uh, the services, the city services are also close by, so it's good. Mm -hmm. uh, being right downtown, I'd say it's the best thing. Yeah, I like it, you know, it's downtown, you know, like it's pretty close to my school, that's the main thing, you know, it's really close to the subway, which is pretty convenient, so that's the main thing. The internet's quite fast, so. Yeah, it's really nice, I mean, it's really clean, organized, it's safe, and uh, the internet works perfectly, in my case, so that's also important. I think in terms of residence bedrooms, that's, I mean, as big as you can get, so in this space is, is very good. Controlling the temperature inside the room is really good, too, so, uh, I think it's a really nice suite to, um, to live in. When I do see them, um, pretty well, but I really don't even see them that much. They're also busy with school, but when I do see them, it's pretty good. But uh, I mean, everyone's busy, so we don't really have time to, uh, to really, really like become good friends. But uh, well, we're, we're good. Um, I think we got along pretty well. So the most important thing is patience and good communication. So we have like a group chat where we express everything, like if we have some issues or if everything's fine, we just talk there and it's really good. Uh, perfectly, actually. So everyone is really fine and friendly from the very beginning. And uh, actually my sweet mates just changed and the next one was also really nice, so no complaint about that. Just be mindful of like noise and stuff because the walls that you can it, you can hear things, you know, like between the rooms. So just like be mindful of noise. But uh, other than that, like you know, just be tidy and stuff, and that's basically it. You know, everyone's pretty chill. I mean, talk to you know, talk to everyone. I mean, everyone here is mostly willing to uh, willing to be friendly with each other. Meet the front desk staff; they can tell you a lot. Um, I think the most important thing is like when you live with other people to be mindful of how you communicate. Um, try not to be passive aggressive and just, you know, if you have something, talk about it in a straightforward manner. And, um, and it should be fine. Just try to get along um, and give a shot. It's really, it's really easy actually. They, those guys are all pretty friendly. Um, they're super friendly and they're super helpful. You never feel like you're bothering them at all. You know, They're always like super eager to help. So. Mm -hmm. In terms of safety, so what we need, and uh, in terms of deliveries and stuff, and uh, eventually when you forgot the keys, they're all always really helpful. People there are very responsible and they're very good. I mean, 
I, I personally know, I know yeah, several of them, and um, they're all willing to help you uh, with anything that you might need from them. Mm -hmm. Getting packages, uh, moving in and uh, moving out, uh, they, they can help you with uh, at any time. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you have any emergencies, you can always call them if you've lost your keys, or if there's something more serious, serious you could probably contact them as well. Uh, I'm kind of, kind of biased because I work there, but I think it's a really nice um, really nice fun desk mm -hmm. and um, people are really friendly and we try our best to help the residents and I haven't really seen an issue that we did not handle mm -hmm. or that we couldn't help residents with. Mm -hmm. So I think we're doing a pretty good job. Um, you know, sometimes people forget their keys and then we like let them in or they have questions about how things are run or the organizations of things. Um, sometimes people from outside our college come and ask questions about like if they want to apply, things like that. So we help with um, lots of aspects, from the physical aspects of like getting into a room and like understanding in general what's going on. I like working at Tyson College a lot because it's an opportunity to meet students from around the world. So ever since I started working for Tartu in March of 2017, I've had a chance to meet literally people from every corner of the world. Uh, yeah, I do feel quite secure here. There's several layers of, of locks uh, around the building, so and uh, you have you have your uh, your own locks on, on your suite, uh, suites, and then uh, even on your personal rooms, you get you know, you get locks. Well, uh, nothing more than getting security guards 24/7 too. The front door locks at a certain time, I believe. So that's also a really good feature about the college. So right. yeah, I mean, I'm from Brazil, so it's really different. <laughs> and this city also helps a lot, right? I mean, it surrounds you safe and. But the same thing uh, with Dr. College is, uh, in my opinion, is like 100% safe. The college these ladies are also sweet. Yeah, they're really sweet and they, um, they stay on top of stuff. Oh, I think it's great. Um, the staff is really nice and really helpful. And um, I think the schedule of the cleaning is really nice. So it's never, there's never too much of an interval. So it's always like really nice and clean. Perfect. Uh, I mean, our place is always clean. I mean, we also uh, try to keep everything clean by ourselves, but the cleaning ladies are really, really good. They're also very nice and uh, very helpful. And I went there on a few occasions and I always got the help that I needed. They're really uh, uh, efficient with everything. And from the very beginning, it was really easy to uh, start living here. And even for the moving out stuff, it was really easy. So, mm -hmm. perfect. Some of the suites have uh, like climate control. So that could be something that like for people who are interested in, in that sort of a thing. Um, I feel like I'm, comf I'm in like a normal suite and I'm very comfortable with that just because I find I'm not extremely sensitive and it's like uh, I'm very comfortable with that. So I had I was expecting it to be a little bit bigger and it wasn't very clear like in the pictures. Mm -hmm. So once I came in like but there is a lot of other like spaces where it's storage spaces I guess but the closet itself isn't as big as I expected. I think it's just um, communication because um, for people coming from different places, even together in the same suite, there will be some conflict and maybe different habits in like daily life. So um, for my own suite, we have like a Facebook Facebook group, so we can talk to each other whenever we have problems with each other or suggestions and stuff. So I think that's a really great way to uh, communicate with other suite mates. That like living here is very easy. And that like having someone that cleans like more than once a week coming in is very nice, but that they should also make sure that they have their own stuff, like their own kitchen supply and all of that, because it's not always available. And like also having a kettle because that's not always there, or a toaster. Be, be clean. Like I'm somebody who, like I like people who are clean, and so I appreciate that in other people as well. Just whenever you live with anybody, you want to just be civil. Uh, stay cleanly. Uh, communicate with everybody you know, uh, make sure you understand how everything works around the building. Reach out to the people here. 
It's a really nice residence for someone if you're looking for something downtown and central and that's around everything. It's really close to the subway, so it's really nice. If you're student at UMG, get 10% off the metro every Tuesday and Wednesday. Yeah, I think if you have a good attitude and you come to live here, you're going to enjoy it really much, very much. And um, good luck. Just come. <laughs> awesome.